In this video, we'll be taking a look at three college basketball games happening on March 22, 2024, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games, so six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports, let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three college basketball games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive sports picks to take your journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer our best single picks, parlay picks, and much more. Now let's get started. Northwestern vs. Florida Atlantic The anticipation mounts as the stage is set for the inaugural clash between the 21-11 Northwestern Wildcats representing the BIG-10 and the 24-7 Florida Atlantic Owls hailing from the American Athletic Conference in the first round of the NCAA tournament. This matchup marks an intriguing encounter between two teams from different conferences, adding an element of unpredictability to the tournament atmosphere. Northwestern, having secured a 9 seed, emerges from a BIG-10 conference that has sent a formidable six teams to the tournament. Their journey to this point saw them finish fourth in the conference's regular season standings and subsequently succumb to Wisconsin in the quarterfinals of the conference tournament. Meanwhile, Florida Atlantic clinched second place in the American Athletic Conference standings with an impressive 14-4 record, only to falter against Temple in the semifinals of their conference tourney. Within the confines of this matchup lies a tale of contrasting fortunes and strategic maneuvers. The Wildcats, though possessing a solid record, find themselves grappling with a sense of uncertainty regarding their momentum heading into the game. The absence of Barry, a pivotal figure renowned for his prowess from long range and precision at the free throw line, casts a shadow over Northwestern's recent performances. Their record of 5-4 without him, including a concerning 1-3 in their last four outings, underscores the impact of his absence. His absence deprives Northwestern of a valuable scoring option, potentially hindering their ability to keep pace with the offensive firepower of Florida Atlantic. On the opposing end, the experienced roster of the Owls harbors a sense of determination, fueled by a desire to avert an early exit following their setback in the conference tournament. Armed with an offensive arsenal capable of applying relentless pressure, Florida Atlantic poses a significant challenge to Northwestern's defensive resilience. The burden falls upon the Wildcats to match their opponent's scoring output, a task exacerbated by the demands of containing an offensive juggernaut. As the game unfolds, questions loom over Northwestern's capacity to sustain their defensive efforts and capitalize on scoring opportunities in the crucial moments of the contest. Analyzing the statistical dynamics further unveils insights into the tactical intricacies of this matchup. Northwestern's defensive proficiency, albeit commendable on paper, confronts scrutiny when juxtaposed with the realities of their performance. While their deliberate style of play contributes to respectable defensive metrics, their vulnerabilities emerge upon closer examination. Opponents have capitalized on opportunities both inside the paint and beyond the arc, exploiting defensive lapses to their advantage. In contrast, Florida Atlantic boasts a formidable presence in the paint with Golden commanding authority and Davis threatening from long range. High highlighting potential avenues of exploitation for the Owls. The strategic narrative extends beyond statistical comparisons to encompass the broader context of team dynamics and playing styles. Northwestern's deliberate pace, reflected in their ranking as the 342nd slowest team in terms of possessions per 40 minutes, shapes their defensive identity. However, this measured approach inadvertently plays into the hands of Florida Atlantic, whose proficiency in both interior scoring and perimeter shooting aligns with the challenges posed by Northwestern's defensive scheme. Despite Northwestern's resilience and the rigors of a challenging schedule, the disparity in rebounding prowess and offensive efficiency tilts the scales in favor of the Owls. Delving into the offensive capabilities of both teams unveils a narrative of contrasting philosophies and strategic imperatives. Northwestern's offensive prowess, exemplified by their impressive field goal and three-point shooting percentages, underscores their ability to generate scoring opportunities. Conversely, Florida Atlantic sees 
season has been marred by inconsistency, characterized by unexpected losses and erratic performances. However, their past exploits, including a memorable run to the Final Four in the previous season, attest to their resilience and collective chemistry, factors that could prove decisive in tournament play. As the game approaches, individual matchups take center stage, offering glimpses of strategic intrigue and tactical finesse. The Buey Davis duel emerges as a focal point, symbolizing the clash of contrasting styles and skill sets. While the individual talents of both players command attention, the supporting cast surrounding Davis holds the key to unlocking Florida Atlantic's offensive potential. In this 8-9 matchup, the collective cohesion and veteran presence of the Owls present a compelling case for their success, setting the stage for a captivating showdown. So the Florida Atlantic Owls to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. In the realm of predictions and betting analysis, the complexities of the matchup find expression in nuanced assessments and strategic considerations. The over-under line reflects a delicate balance between contrasting styles of play and offensive proficiency. Northwestern's efficiency on offense, particularly in the aftermath of a loss, suggests the potential for an entertaining display of scoring prowess. However, the fast-paced nature of Florida Atlantic's offense and their ability to exploit defensive vulnerabilities signal a high-scoring affair. In this context, aligning with the narrative of an up-tempo contest characterized by offensive fireworks and back-and-forth action, over the projected total is our full-game total pick. Colgate vs. Baylor Friday's installment of the NCAA tournament unveils an enticing clash in the West region as the 14th-seeded Colgate Red Raiders square off against the third-seeded Baylor Bears at the FedEx Forum in Memphis, Tennessee. The Red Raiders, boasting a commendable 25-9 record for the season, enter the fray as reigning champions of the Patriot League. On the other hand, the Bears arrive with a tally of 23-10 having secured the third spot in the fiercely contested Big 12 competition. Colgate brings to the court a wealth of tournament experience, having made four consecutive appearances. Demonstrating commendable efficiency, they find themselves among the top 100 teams nationwide in terms of fewest turnovers per game. Moreover, the Red Raiders exhibit prowess in shooting, occupying the 54th position in the country for field goal percentage. Their defensive acumen, particularly against perimeter shots, shines through as they clinch the 10th rank in college basketball basketball for three-point defense, a crucial aspect given Baylor's proficiency in long-range shooting. The Bears, however, are coming off a subpar performance against Iowa State, struggling to breach the 20% mark from beyond the arc. Notably, Baylor's recent sluggish starts raise concerns, possibly prompting them to rally in the latter stages of the game. Despite foreseeing a Baylor victory, the Colgate Raiders to cover the spread as underdogs is our full-game side pick. In this showdown, both teams find themselves situated in the lower echelons of the nation's tempo rankings, with Colgate at 253rd and Baylor at 280th according to Ken Palm. A remarkable 35 games between the two have favored the under this season. Baylor's offensive output has waned in recent outings, with four of their last six games witnessing scores of 68 points or less. Conversely, their defensive fortitude shines through, limiting opponents to 62 points or less in four of their last 11 matchups. Colgate's Defensive resilience is equally noteworthy, having stifled opposing offenses for 17 consecutive games without allowing more than 65 points. Despite their offensive production dipping in recent encounters, the Red Raiders maintain a strategic approach, recognizing the significance of containing Baylor's scoring surges. Anticipating a methodical start to proceedings as both sides gauge each other's strengths, the overarching theme remains a deliberate pace. With Colgate ranked 253rd and Baylor 281st nationally in tempo, a cautious approach is expected. Baylor's reliance on three-pointers contrasts with Colgate's stout perimeter defense, complemented by their 10th rank in scoring defense across the nation. Familiar with such situations, Colgate understands the importance of stifling Baylor's offensive rhythm. Regardless of the initial pace, both teams are inclined towards deceleration. Hence, under the projected total is our full-game total pick. UAB vs. San Diego State In the upcoming first-round clash within the East region of the NCAA tournament, the 12th-seeded UAB Blazers, boasting a season record of 23-11, will square off against the 5th-seeded San Diego State Aztecs, who hold a record of 24-10. UAB secured their berth in the NCAA tournament by triumphing over Temple with a commanding 16-point victory in the American Athletic Conference Championship game. Throughout their regular season, the Blazers showcased their prowess, culminating in a commendable 
fourth place finish within the American Athletic Conference, boasting a notable 12-6 record. Conversely, San Diego State clinched the fifth seed in the NCAA tournament following their 11-7 performance in the Mountain West Conference, a feat that saw them spend a considerable portion of the season ranked in the top 25, reaching as high as 17th. Emerging victorious in the American Athletic Conference Tournament, UAB cemented their place in the prestigious NCAA Tournament, setting the stage for a compelling showdown against San Diego State, the national runner-up from the 2022-2023 season. UAB's journey to the big dance was marked by a remarkable surge in form at a critical juncture, triumphing over formidable opponents such as Wichita State, South Florida, and Temple. Since their defeat against Memphis on March 3rd, the Blazers have been on an impressive streak, securing victories in five five consecutive games while also covering the spread in four of those encounters, which notably included notable wins against Drake and Florida Atlantic. Conversely, the Aztecs encountered a setback in the Mountain West tournament finale, succumbing to a loss against New Mexico. Their recent performance has been somewhat lackluster, with just one victory in the last six games and a less than ideal against the spread record of 1-5 during that span. Nonetheless, San Diego State has demonstrated their mettle throughout the season with notable wins against formidable opponents such as Gonzaga, Long Beach State, and St. Mary's, indicating their capability to compete against any adversary. Anticipated as a hard-fought contest, against the Pacey UAB squad. The Aztecs are expected to draw upon the experience garnered from last season's impressive run to secure a hard-earned victory. Nevertheless, given UAB's resilience, they are poised to remain competitive. So the UF Blazers to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick. Throughout the season, both San Diego State and UAB have exhibited proficiency in scoring, with the Aztecs averaging 75 points per game and the Blazers notching an average of 77 points per game. Noteworthy trends have emerged, with the total points surpassing the set threshold in four of UAB's last six games and in all of their last five encounters against teams hailing from the Mountain West Conference. Analyzing the team's playing styles, Kempum's data reveals that UAB maintains an adjusted tempo of 67.8, placing them at 100. 54th, while San Diego State's tempo stands at 66, ranking them 256th. While these statistics may not suggest a high-scoring affair, both teams possess the capability to generate sufficient points, likely surpassing the projected total score. Consequently, the outlook leans towards the total score exceeding the final closing line, making over the projected total our full-game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyzed, subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.